guy you are seeing right now survived without sleeping for 11 days. Set a record by staying awake. 11 days and 11 nights. It seems impossible, but he managed to stay awake for exactly 11 days and 24 minutes. But how did he do it? Going without sleep for 264 hours, exactly 11 days. In December 1963, a 17-year-old boy named Randy Gardner started a sleep deprivation experiment for a high school science project. He conducted this experiment with his two friends, Bruce and Joe. The experiment was done in a San Diego hospital and was monitored by a group of scientists. After two days without sleeping, he began experiencing mood changes and tiredness. During an interview, he stated that I noticed that in the morning I was really nauseous and that's when I stumbled on eating citrus for some reason. Uh, tangerines or oranges seemed to take the nausea away. On the fifth day, he began to experience hallucinations and encountered difficulty retaining short-term memories. As the days passed, Randy resorted to various tricks to stay awake. He would play basketball and go bowling. However, the nights were the most challenging since there was nothing to do, making it unbearable to keep his eyes open. According to Gardner, his two friends stayed with him during the nights to help him stay awake and monitor his condition. How did you pass the time when the other people were sleeping? Well, there were always there was always someone with me, the two boys that helped me. One would sleep and one would stay awake with oh. me. On the eleventh day, he was asked to subtract seven from hundred repeatedly, but he stopped at sixty-five. When asked why, he said he forgot what he was doing. On that same day, on January 8, 1964, at 2 a.m., he accomplished his goal of staying awake for 264 hours, which equals eleven days. After the experiment, he slept for 14 hours and when he woke up, everything had returned to normal. How long did you sleep the minute you were through with the 11 days and nights? Uh, 14 hours and 43 minutes. And did you feel lousy when you woke up or was it great? <laughs> well, not great, but it was okay. William DeMent, a sleep researcher who monitored Gardner during the experiment, found that his brain experienced microsleep. A microsleep is a brief involuntary episode of sleep that typically lasts for a few seconds. They can happen without you even realizing it. This microsleep is the body's response to cope with sleep deprivation. So in the case of Gardner, although he looked awake, parts of his brain weren't active, which helped him to stay awake for such a long time. Although Gardner did not experience any extreme side effects from the sleep deprivation experiment, he began to suffer from insomnia in the late 2000s and is convinced that his teenage experiment was responsible for his current condition. About 10 years ago, I stopped sleeping. I could not sleep. And now Randy Gardner, who set a world record of not sleeping for 11 days, regrets his decision and believes that sleep is equally important as water and food.